this tutorial, you'll learn how to save and organize articles in Google Scholar. Therefore, you'll know how to save an an article that you find to my library, how to access my library, which contains all your saved articles, and then how to organize the articles that you have added to my library. So when you're on Google Scholar, my library is located in the top left corner of the browser. You click on that, and then I've already saved a bunch of articles. Let's say I'm doing research on antibiotic resistance. So I have made a bunch of different what are called tabs, and then I have all my articles here. So if we look in a specific tab, I've organized different articles based on the subject. So I will show you how to do this, but first we must search. So we'll go back to Google Scholar and we'll find some more articles. So let's look. And so now that we've searched this, if there's any articles that I find interesting, then I can press the little star which is located under that article. And then it saves that article to my library. So now we go back to my library, which is now located over here, and the top articles that I just picked are now in the library. One thing to note about how it's laid out, if you press here, then you can cite the article in MLA, APA, Chicago, Harvard, Vancouver format. So that's one good thing to know. So now if I want to make new tabs, we go to Manage Labels. Create new label and press create. So now we press back and then we select these articles, go up here to the labels, and then put it in the label I just created and press apply. So now if we go back to that label, then all those articles are now located in this label. That's how you can easily organize your overall library and add articles to make a easy to navigate database with all your articles for whatever research topic you may be researching.